What's up guys, Chris Romulo aka Crom here with you again and I'll be showing you how to develop full body coordination, agility, mobility, and speed using your body weight, okay? The movement is called a sitru. Okay, this is a movement that I was taught in some of my wrestling and jujitsu practice through the years. It's a really great exercise, even just talking about developing core strength and obviously arm and leg strength if you can see since you are balanced on all four i'll go through a couple reps on each side and then we'll rewind it and then break down what exactly a sit through is here's a lazy sit through where you shouldn't be practicing in that f in that fashion all right let's bring it all the way back to the beginning So again, a sit-through is a, it's a coordination movement used by wrestlers and jiu-jitsu guys. But again, if you're a Muay Thai practitioner, this will help you with your rotational strength. Okay, And as most of you know or hopefully know that Muay Thai is all about using your hips to rotate and generate power for your punches, kicks, knees, and elbows. So if you can see here, the sit-through starts on all fours. Okay? You're on your hands and your feet. You're going to start the movement by lifting or twisting your hips. Okay. And notice one hand comes or the opposite hand comes off of the ground. So if my left leg is going to be sitting through, my right hand is going to be coming up into the air. And notice my butt touches the ground on each repetition, just so again, I know I'm going through full ranges of motion. And then I'm going to come back to the middle. Then I'm going to rotate and twist onto the, or twist through on the opposite side, sitting through with the right leg, left hand comes up into the air. And notice I also use my head, so I look up as I sit through. If you guys are using this for technical purposes, this is going to make sure your head is driving into your opponent's body to sit through as you're using this to defend. If this is just an exercise, it's not so important what you're doing with your head as long as your hips and your body are moving through in a good fashion. So again, here, sitting through, butt to the ground, rotating the body. Always coming back to all fours. Okay. Here are a couple bad reps again where my foot is just laying on the ground and I'm just kind of resting there. You don't want to rest in this exercise. This is a, a dynamic exercise of rotation through the spine and your hips and legs. And you want to keep it moving. Okay. So here again. Let's go back to a couple good reps. Oh, no, that's a bad one, too. Couple good reps here. Sit through, foot stays off of the ground. Notice the foot stays off of the ground here just so that it's just your butt touching the ground. So that's your sit through for coordination, agility, and mobility, guys. Chris Romulo. AKA Crom signing out. Stay tuned for our next vid or go to crompc.com slash or backslash puzzle to download your free e puzzle that I've developed for Muay Thai fighters. Okay, it's movements or it's actually ten a ten piece puzzle of components that you should have in your training. All the components that you should have in your training if you want to better yourself as a fighter. Or even just a practitioner. All it takes is heart. And I'll see you guys soon.